I think the most important thing about being a utilitarian is that you judge actions in accordance with their consequences. Things are not just right or wrong in themselves, irrespective of the difference they make in the world. And I think that it's important that we make a difference in the world uh, and not that we stick by some abstract principle which might say, for example, uh, always tell the truth, um, but then might have disastrous consequences for everyone. And, and I see no point in sticking by a principle without paying attention to the consequences of what you're doing. So that's the first and most important aspect for me of being a utilitarian. The utilitarian movement was founded in the late 18th century by the English philosopher Jeremy Bentham. He came from a family of lawyers and was trained to be a lawyer, but he didn't practice the profession. Instead, he dedicated himself to the reform of the British legal system and social policy. Bentham's central proposal was deceptively simple. He wrote, Nature has placed mankind under the governance of two sovereign masters, pain and pleasure. It is for them alone to point out what we ought to do. Bentham proposed designing all laws and social policies with one goal, maximize the amount of pleasure in society and minimize the amount of pain. Show no favoritism to individuals, but seek only to bring about the greatest happiness for the greatest number. Philosopher Ross Harrison has written a book about Bentham. The importance of Bentham is he really worked out a utilitarian theory. So it wasn't just the starting point, but you developed what that actually was and then applied it to lots of different areas. I mean, you've got psychological theory, you've got value theory, you put them together, you get a theory of politics, of law, of society. And it's that whole development that makes Bentham important.